we're gonna build a wall of chocolate here. We're gonna make this amazing. It's like a special pillow painting. It's so, so soft. soft. Those right there, a little bit over. Yep, boom. Boom. Bing, bang, bang, boom. All right, sweet. Today we're showing at my friends Megan and Jason our house on Orange Street and they've been mulling the idea of downtown. So we're gonna just hopefully get some feedback from them, maybe tempt them enough, I don't know, we'll see. You guys are way up on the north side now. What is your, your commute downtown? Sometimes it's up to like 45 minutes on the morning. What? And, um... Yeah. And you could be spending that hour and a half that you lose every day on the road with your family. Oh, I like that. This is it. All right. Go on ahead. Go on. Take a look. See what you think. <gasps> How cute. Oh, wow. I love the color. Oh, it's beautiful. Love the blue and the white trim. That is so darling. I love the height of the house, too. Mm -hmm. It's really pretty. The original house had actually been hit by a car and knocked off of its foundation. So every wall was wobbly, and it was really just beyond saving. So hopefully this one is a much better addition to the neighborhood. You guys want to go in? Yeah, let's do it. You go ahead. Okay, I, I bring up the rear. That's right. my job. <laughs> Ready. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, I love the lights. Holy cow. So we kept the exact same footprint for the house, but then now when you walk in, all your public spaces in the front. There, I love that. It's really that. nice and open. Yeah. And then we windowed the heck out yeah. of the place. Sure. Because it was so dark. Yeah, it's yeah. very bright in here. Usually, a mom likes to try to save something from the original house. And we were digging uh, to dig the new foundation, and that box was down in there. So oh, I took it cool. home, and I cleaned wow. it up a little bit. Wow, that is really neat. I like the antique look of it, too, because yeah. it does match with all the decor in here. Do you want to go look closer at the kitchen? Yes. Yeah. I think there's a farm sink calling your name. Oh, yay! Oh, this is so awesome. Oh, I love wow. this sink and the backsplash. Yeah. Before, there was a small bathroom off the kitchen, but we figured it made more sense to make this all kitchen space. Look at all the cabinets, too. Yeah, oh, yeah, all that storage up there. That's great. Perfect. And you've got pantry oh, here. Oh, nice. Oh, I like that. So it's not a huge footprint, mm -hmm. but I think we've packed in a lot of storage for yeah, what you have here. Absolutely. The openness is really beautiful. You want to head to the back and check that out? Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. So we've got a little guest half bath here. Oh, perfect. I love the tall ceilings all yeah. throughout the property, too. Mm -hmm. And pretty color in here, too, mm -hmm. for a bathroom, you know? Nice. Soft. All right, well, we've got one of two master options that we can check out now. Okay. First of two options as en suites. Oh, okay. this is this awesome. This is a cute room. So it's nice, just kind of tucked in the back of the house, a yes. little private. That pop of color in here, though, with this, you know, this grayish tone in here is beautiful. So Mom and I made these. Oh, my god. So and it was really fun. It was. Right. It was they amazing. turned out great. It's a little spice. like it. OK, Good we'll job. check out the ensuite bathroom. Cool. OK. You guys can go ahead and pop oh, your heads I in there. I love this. Perfect. Oh, this is so pretty. And the tile in the shower is beautiful. It is. So this one can be used as, I mean, I feel like you'd probably use it as your guest room because the upstairs has the bigger bathroom. OK. But now you have a first floor option, and we can go upstairs um, and check out all the stuff we've got going on up there. Awesome. Go ahead. Got this lovely little loft oh, at the top of the what stairs. A space. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is fabulous. It's perfect for our daughter when she's just playing on the ground with all her blocks and toys. And I mean, this is a great study area. This is absolutely beautiful. And the colors in here, again, just gorgeous. So we like to bring something a little bit old back into every house. Oh, cool. And so I went into Karen's corner, and I dug out some old corbels. And there's another one over there that matches. 
and made these little side tables that just sit on the wall. They turned out great. It's beautiful. Yeah. I feel like we should show them the, what is this, this is the probably, second bedroom. Yeah, this is probably what you would have as your guest bedroom office. Okay. So this is your, really whatever you want to use it for room. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is great. This is a great room. Before, the old house had this slanted roof line up here, but we wanted to make it much taller, so this room had much more functional space. I love the floors. What, what are those? These are actually laminate. They make really good laminate options now. And we went with a wider plank on these, too, because I think it makes it, it makes it feel less busy, mm -hmm. a little bit more open. I agree. So do you want to see your master? Uh, we do. Let's check it out. This is your master. Oh, my gosh. Oh, this is perfect. It's a okay. king-size bed. It yeah. Is. Yeah, and there's still plenty of room. Got a nice little sitting area. Yeah. yeah. And do you see your view? You can right. see oh my goodness. the entire, you can see the football stadium right there. Yeah. That, like, right downtown, that's the center of it. This has an awesome ensuite. Ooh. So, let's uh, check that out. Let's check it out. Barn door. Take a peek on oh in there. Oh, my gosh. Oh, wow. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, that is gorgeous. I love the size of the shower. Yeah, perfect. That's awesome. Well, you want to go downstairs and eat some yummy stuff and chatter on the table? We want some of your, I mean, more of your feedback. <laughs> You've said all the right things, but. <laughs> We'd love to. Let's go. Yeah. It certainly has all the appeal of being close to downtown, and I think, you know, every design element of the house fits our lifestyle. I mean, just every space in this house we would use every day. Yeah, so it's all it's very great. functional space. It is an incredible home. I, I don't know if we'll move downtown just yet, but if we were to, this would be the home for sure. Absolutely. Cheers. Yeah. You guys you did an amazing job. I do think getting their feedback and, OK, yes, this works for you guys. This works for you even though you have a little one. Uh, I think makes means we're on the right page. We paid $9,000 for the house, and our renovation costs were around $180,000. We listed the house for $235,000, and even though Megan and Jason didn't buy it, we did get an offer for the full list price, which means after closing costs and fees, we're going to make around $40,000. So the house was a great win for us and hopefully also for the family who now gets to call it home.